Let's customize our tags a little bit with some custom fields. Uh, let's head into our control panel, go to our tags taxonomy, and then we're gonna edit the blueprint for it. Okay, these are the blueprints that are assigned. You can have more than one, not something we're gonna worry about in this video, but these are the fields that are attached to every tag. And you can set these on every single tag and add some more data uh, to pull onto the front end. So let's go ahead and add a text field. We're gonna call it emoji because why not? We move that up above here. We're gonna get rid of the author field. I don't really feel like that is that important as well as template, not something we're gonna customize in this video. So we're gonna hit save, head back to our tags and you can see all the tags here. You can go ahead and pre-create tags in the control panel before they're ever used in an entry, giving your users uh, some pre-built options to go from. And uh, so let's go ahead and edit placeholder. And then for the emoji, uh, what's, a, what's a good placeholder emoji? Like a box? That sounds good. Uh, these are posts about placeholder-y things. I'm gonna save that, and then maybe in phishing, we'll add a phishing emoji. Bam. I love phishing, don't you? I really do. I really love phishing. Puns, maybe in a, a, a smirking emoji, smirk. Every good joke needs a dad to make it more better. And the last one, beach. That's going to be an easy emoji. That looks like a beach because there's nothing like a good beach day for fun activities. All right, back to the front end go into our code editor and we're going to add that emoji field around the title emoji copy and paste emoji sometimes are pretty tight let's give some space around that and then underneath we'll add uh, the content field there text center give it some margin and let's see what this looks like i really didn't center Oh, this is a markdown field. All right, so markdowns are going to pre-render that P. I would have noticed if I looked a little bit closer. Instead of that, oh, instead of a P tag, we're just going to add a wrapper div. And there we go. Maybe make the text large and bold. All right, every good dad joke needs, or every good joke needs a dad to make more better. <laughs> That's terrible. Nobody stopped me. Nobody stopped me. Oh my gosh, you guys are terrible. All right, make sure these are all looking good. Yeah, I mean, it's really that easy. You can add whatever fields you want. You can pull that information out on that, uh, like the tab, blog tags index page if you wanted to. Uh, we could show that, which would be here. Pull that in. There you have it. I hope you're getting the hang of taxonomies. They're really not that hard. They just have some conventions you need to learn. That's it.